Everybody, Marcos Vegas here at the Mayweather Boxing Club with Mr. Roger Mayweather, the Black Mamba himself. Roger, how's training camp been going? I know we haven't heard too, too much, but uh, how's Floyd's looking and uh, how, what kind of work have you been doing with him? Floyd's well, been doing well. He's uh, been very busy. He uh, threw a lot of punches. I mean, Floyd's sharp, actually. He's very sharp. Even though the layoff that he had, but he's very sharp. From, even from the layoff that he had because he had good sparring, he had a, a good guy to spar with, so I think he's going to be prepared. He gonna be, I think he's going to be prepared and I think he's going to be that much sharper. Looking at Robert Guerrero as an opponent, you know, is there something that you feel Floyd hasn't seen before in, in other fighters that Robert possesses? I don't think so. Floyd been boxing. Floyd been boxing all his life. So, uh, in terms of him seeing something that somebody else ever done, I I ain't ever seen it happen. I mean, Floyd and probably every fighter that's out there, and name wise, name wise, and probably skill wise go. He didn't fight. He didn't fight all those guys. I mean, so guys like uh, Guerrero, uh, the guy that the guy that he been working with. He, the guy he's been working with is uh, a very sharp, and uh, I mean, I see what he do to them, so I can't see him, what he won't do to, to Guerrero, because I don't think he's much better than the guy that that probably been working with. Guerrero, Guerrero yesterday mentioned to us that he feels that he's the, the strongest mentally that Floyd has faced, given the, what happened with his wife and, and the stuff that he's gone through. I just wanted to get your thoughts on that. What are you saying? That Guerrero feels that he's the strongest opponent Floyd will face mentally. He, he's okay. mentally stronger than any of Floyd's opponents. I ain't never seen a motherfucker because he, he believed what he, what he believed don't mean anything. The whole thing, boxing, boxing is about what you know a whole a, a person can say anything he want, but until you get up in here and face the one that you you supposed to uh, believe that can't beat you, he already know one thing. Floyd ain't never been beat. Floyd ain't beat every guy that's out there. So I don't think that uh, that he believe. I don't think that he even believe that he can beat Floyd. I don't think he believe he can beat Floyd. I mean. I mean, I, I see them fight some other guys, but I don't think he—I don't think he believes what he say. But if he do, that's okay. But I don't believe it. I don't believe it. And Floyd gonna make him not believe it because that's what he does. Looking at the camp as well, how's it like having your brother back now working with uh, Floyd as well? And how's that dynamic been between you, Floyd Senior, and? Uh, don't bother me. Don't bother me, brother. Dad back, don't, don't bother Does it make you happy that he's back in camp? Why would it make me happy? Father and son reunited and all that? Yeah, but why would it make me happy? Uh, it don't make me happy. It don't, don't make me happy one way or the other. I've been training for 15, going on 16 years. I, it don't bother me. It don't bother me. I mean, my thing is that, uh, my, my thing is that, that he performed that he performed, and that's that's basically what it's about, you know. I mean that uh, that Floyd perform, and that I mean he, he give a, he give a, a, a good a good performance so that the people can understand that he's still the best guy in the game. Speaking of uh, performing wise, looking at Floyd, he looks in excellent shape, like you mentioned. At, at 36, it seems the older Floyd has gotten, the better physically he looks. You know, I guess. You seeing him and being in there with, with him, how long do you feel he still be able to compete at this high level? Yeah. Well, the thing with Floyd, Floyd will be, be able to box. Floyd will actually be able to box when he's 40 years old if he wants to. Because Floyd understand about boxing. Yeah. Floyd understand about boxing. He understand how not to get hurt. He understand on what he needs to do. I don't think he'll fight that long, but he can fight that long. I don't think he will, but he, he Floyd will still have skills at 40 years old to be able to beat most of the guys that's out there in boxing. 
But most of the guys out there, he'll still be able to beat most of them, even though he be even though he's up in age. Speaking of, uh, I guess you, you know, uh, I know a lot's been made about your health. How are you doing now? Are you feeling better? Uh, give us an update. I'm fine. I mean, I mean, well, I mean, <laughs> I don't, I, I don't know how so much got on about my health, about this, about that. I've been training, I've been training him all, all this time, but my health. My hope, my health post is deteriorated. At last time I checked, but hey, it is what it is. My thing is that you know uh, is keep my health and do what I need to do to get to stay healthy. I mean, I'm a diabetic. You know how many people are diabetic in the state in, in the United States? Over 300 million. So. I'm not the first guy to have to be a diabetic, and I'm not the last guy to be a diabetic. It's over 300 guys that are diabetic, so what's, what's wrong with me? Because I'm a diabetic too. Don't mean because I'm a diabetic, I can't take care of my kid, or I'm a diabetic, I can't uh, eat the right thing, or this or that. I mean, it is what it is. People say what they want. Switching topics now. I know Canelo wanted to fight your nephew in September and uh, I know you've been asked this but I, I wanted to get your opinion on him for our viewers you know uh, what do you feel about Canelo do you feel he's a good fighter do, do you feel that he would be competitive if he fought Canelo Floyd yeah. Canelo good fighter I see him I see him fight more than once you know uh, he's a good fighter and uh, I'm sure at, 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 at some time and sometime and at some point I hope uh, whatever that him and Paul will fight, I don't know when, but hopefully that the fight will happen. That seems to be like the new Mayweather-Pacquiao. A lot of fans, a lot of, lot of fans want Canelo and your nephew. Yeah, I mean, so if that fight happens, then uh, Paul got to get ready for it. That's all to it. And then we'll see uh, if he can do what he say he won't do with Floyd. Yeah. You never know. We got, we got to see it. So until that time come, if they make the fight and the fight happen, we all good. Roger, it's always great to uh, chat with you. I know you have a message here for uh, all your doubters right here. <laughs> your shirt right here. They say that. <laughs> the haters. Lord have mercy. Here well, <laughs> those are the guys that don't believe. So if they don't believe me, that's okay. You got to keep making them believe. That's it. <laughs> Here with Roger Mayweather and Marcos Vegas for the Boxing Channel.